what is up y'all it is me tasha c and this particular video y'all i will be talking about kai sinet in two situations two you know mini discussions i guess you could say with my commentary now the first part i'll be talking about kai sinet and the controversy about the stream he did not too long ago to be in october the beginning of this month of november you know um, by the way, y'all, I'm recording this after uh, the day at the Thanksgiving, aka Turkey Day, whatever. You know, we're getting ready for the rest of these quote unquote happy holidays slash the end of the, um, you know, getting ready for the new year. Uh, 22, uh, 2024. Now, it's controversy in both of, you know, of these topics because some people are trying to say Kai Sinet was basically like glamorizing, um, you know like seven days you know jail like uh, you know it's like an influence and stuff and then you would hear the controversial which you know um thing with having the rapper our, our little rt which he is a nine-year-old boy and stuff he's talking about like who the hell thought this was a good idea but we're gonna look some clip first like this is from the og if y'all heard the I, uh, idc world group and they leaving chris next door i think was leaving too it was like like i said this was like i think the seventh like night or last day and they quote quote like bailed out like i said it was a 24 hour seven hour stream and then you know when little art the a clip uh real quick with them and then we're gonna go back to the subject thank you bro thank you bro appreciate you bro appreciate you my boy no appreciate thank you bro thank you bro Ugly ass did you, wait, hold on. Did you know that you was coming? Huh? You said ugly ass people? No, I thought I was coming tomorrow. Oh, you think you're coming tomorrow? Yeah. Oh, you should, nah, you're not going. You came today. Hey, I, I, I got you a twin. Where my phone is? You got a phone? Now, personally to me, y'all, I don't think that he was trying, is trying to influence anybody with the seven days of jail thing, whatever. If we went by that. There's plenty of other examples. You know, this won't be the first and last time, like I said, people have used like prison jail. I can't speak, you know, I know people close love to me that both been in jail and pr uh, uh, prison. I can't speak on those terms, but what I can speak is like, you know, being not, of course, and being unbiased. Like, I, you know, I didn't look at it as him trying to promote things. He had his little scare straight stuff in there. He didn't, you know, he only had internet on one computer. He, he let them keep his phone, even though it was camera somewhere, he let them keep his phone. Um, the whole time it's there to a show when he was being quote quote released after the streams were done okay and um we're gonna look at some clips and stuff like that um about it yeah like i said we'll get into this a little better later on yeah but he was saying you know you actually watch the stream you will you would have seen like you know we did have shagger he wasn't trying to sit there and you know like i said personally me promoting thing like you know i'll even show uh, something a little later on y'all like you would think like the way they were talking about this that he was like promoting like this was the best thing in jail like you could you know have sign you could have all this <laughs> Uh, you could have sex and all all the stuff you want and shit right in the during j j jail cells of sauna and you got you know you get roommates it's like kind of anything but i will show like the 15 most quote quote best prison in the world in an article i read about whatever but first i'm going to show y'all a couple clips where now you know like from the stream 
and also you know his statement and a little article which is not that long but let's get into your y'all about first about his stream and then i'll be back you know a little later on chat so i got a whole production team it's not just chris and ryan There's cameras everywhere 24 7 like bro it's gonna be bro chat every single day we keep going on it's gonna get crazier, 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 and crazier. Nigga, we have we have recess, full on basketball court, everything, bro, everything, everything. We gotta get money. There's a whole commissary, nigga. When is rage? Okay. Look, I'm gonna show the name. My nigga, like, hey, pull up, bro. Pull up a seat or some shit, my nigga. Yeah, come on, talk to my niggas. So, what's crazy is, I don't know, chat, all the guests that y'all see for the trailer, y'all see, right? But to be honest, I do not know what's coming on which day. It is a mystery. I, I, I want to put myself in y'all shoes, so they didn't tell me. I just know who's coming, but I don't know what day they're coming And what y'all seen doing the trailer is only a fraction of the people that's going to join you. Okay? It's only a fraction. It's not even... It's not even everybody. So there's more. Right? Yo, bro, you good, gang? Yo, pull up, gang. Hey. I'm not even breathing in the Oh, back to back. Oh, they might be dying, bro. Why the fuck is they storm like that? Yo, oh my god. Gotta be out of way to find peace in here, bro. Cause what the fuck is that? Shit. Can I get everybody in the chat to say fuck blue face? Can y'all hear me? Oh, we shit. No audio. Uh, no, we just try to sing. Oh, okay. Let's do it. Let's uh, see. Uh, I don't think they can hear mine. Nah. <laughs> oh, I'm cool with everybody. Oh, I'm oh, cool the mic, the mic is cool copy, 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 You don't want to be here. You don't want to be here. Fresh meat. 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 Ah! Let me out, nigga. That nigga shake me, bro. Bro, these niggas really terrified of them bitches. What's up? 
Now, y'all, I forgot to mention that, you know, originally everyone was supposed to be there. He was had like from most of them were like also from like YouTube, others, you know, other content creators. He had he had DDG, he had Your Rage, you know, most of boys are called AMP, um, that group, RDC World, I mentioned Drewski. Offset was supposed to be there, but he pulled out for the last month. We don't know. We don't know why, but like i said it was what i did see you also is even though it's three hours long like the best of the the uh, the the jail seven day jail stream on um on youtube but like i said if we look at this 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 is not the first or last you know person maybe using jail whether it's a skit whether it's two or three minutes or four minutes hour and we went back back for like like influences even though like you know they got shows which i never watched by the fact like oz you had the movie life you had um life at the lockup love during lockup all this shit you also can look at like remember the video if, if you look at the day was the good day the next video that was kind of like like you might say part two is when they rest ice cube character at day good day and he just got out of prison just by a female ceo giving him some c you know some clothes cvos and he walked out that bitch but what i'm saying is is that he shouldn't like be accountable and it, it wasn't like like i said to sit here and look at jail it's like that was a fun thing to do that was like scary street because really truthfully uh, based on what i seen that it was nothing there that made it like spectacular of course with certain things let you know that wasn't all you know that it was fictional and shit but at the same time that sh that was not spectacular what the hell he was showing okay after i sh you know show the statement stuff i'm going to you know in a couple more clips i'm going to sh it, it show an article and read that y'all before we get to the second half y'all of me talking about this controversy uh, with this little a uh, little uh, um little rt and him watching the controversy surrounding him and causing that you know as far as i'm concerned what i see try to do the best he can with him but um it's just like why why is this baby you know this baby has to be a rapper um by saying saying these things which some of the shit he ain't supposed to be saying even he was an adult but we'll get to that after this okay i just wanted to say this real quick this is from your rage and 20 because it was um somebody was saying What's more beats? Jail string, y'all don't think the labels or something higher up come up with these ideas. Labels are controlled, you know, like what listen and listen to. And I know for a fat person to me that probably most likely uh um Kai that does not get paid to just promote music, or whatever. And a lot, you know, at least what I've seen get down spin. Now, if he would have been paid by labels, then him and Gorilla, which she doesn't take restricted criticism, they're the same young um this is the same young lady that was up there. They were flirting each other just a couple months ago. Now she blocked him because he didn't like the cha cha slide. I heard that shit that was garbage and he, you know, didn't like it neither. And you know he didn't even like summer, even though he was in a video. Had, um, I didn't watch the whole stream and stuff. But about Offset, you know, there's some people that speculate that that's the reason why Offset decided to cancel being on on a thing. But it could be from other reasons. You know, on November the first, I got um RSP um takeoff, and also uh, RSP to my uncle Haywood. Uh, Haywood, they they died exactly a year, uh, uh, passed away exactly a year ago on that same day so he may be in mourning um also probably thought about it you know thought about it because i mean you know also has served time before and maybe he thought about maybe it was a good idea and change his mind we don't know but what i've seen if you google lest they change in a day or two he's still at least on instagram i don't know if he'd be on you know instagram like that um you know as far as like i follow, don't follow that type of shit but he is still following kai Sinet. so but let me read this quote with I need y'all to keep that same energy all forms of entertainment involving jail movies, shows, music, cause you fake woke ass niggas uh wake up fake mad. Yeah. <sighs> Tom, a Kaisenet new celebrity, Kaisenet disclosed inspiration about 24 hours, seven days in jail. I share wanted to make it by Arazu Kalan, published uh, 455. You know, I think this was Pacific uh, time at November the 3rd, 2023. Um, he had actually started his stream like towards like the last week of um 
October and it ended like, you know, the beginning of November. Let's say it was seven days. New York City, New York Twitch streamer and YouTuber Kai Sinead recently started his 24-hour, uh, seven-day stream from jail. During the stream, Sinead revealed what was spying the viral prison stream. Kai Sinead was charged in inciting a riot, unlawfully assembly, and a few other charges by the NYPD Chief of Department Jeffrey Murray after being arrested by the department. Okay. Why is uh, Kaisen is streaming for jail? Sinet said that speaking with other prisoners, he thought of streaming from jail. The Twitch streamer revealed that the show named 60 Days inspired him to create the jail stream. 60 Days In is a A&E television docuseries that follows volunteers incarcerated as undercover prisoner for 60 days. The show premiered in 2016 and has since renewed for multiple seasons with the first season featuring a cast made up entirely of former inmates. Kaisen had spoke about his time in a prison to do certain work. He stayed the whole point of this for real. The whole thing uh, when, when I was watching 60 Days Ends, I liked the show. He went on to say, it's crazy that I wanted to make it. But at the same time, it's a good way to show people why you don't want to be in here in prison. We're waking up at 6. We complain at uh, every meal we get. The water is freezing cold. We got this, bro. Excuse me, y'all. He further added, we could have, if I wanted to, got a, a cheese system, got us some nice hot water. Your bro just bring the truck. They didn't, they didn't even know it was a truck that comes every, every I don't know, like 11 hour, 11 minutes through a tube from the container in the back of a truck. He included, we have 20 minutes to use this thing in this cold water. And if you miss it, you miss it 20 minutes. So everybody, you know, so everybody, bro, I don't want to be in my own shower with a big speaker bumping baby in them. Okay, Kaisen had royal justice to protect the girl within seven days. Kaisen again popular, especially if he didn't express his attachment to a prisoner went viral. One girl seated. Name is okay. Oh, this is just like seeing when he was talking about can you protect me? I can protect you. Blah blah blah. Middle, okay. It, it's just that was pretty much in it but just i really want to explain um the reason why um it would inspire him to do the stream actually click on a fucking stream you weird fucks little niggas was going based off the motherfucking clips and saying what they had to say about it but were you there when we did a whole where i, where I literally got the kids of the community the baddest kids of the community to come to the jail. We actually sat down and spoke to them niggas. Oh, you, oh, you didn't see that, right? Or a thousand times where I said, yo, this is not cool. I don't want to be here. I don't like being here. This is why you shouldn't want to be here. Oh, you didn't see that, right? Or me waking up at 6 a.m. shivering out my sleep, back hurt, eating whack-ass food, saying this is why you don't want to be here. Oh, you didn't see that, right? Oh, but you've seen all the other clips that went viral. And then you're going to say I glorified it, right? My nigga, if you ask me, I was moving from 6 a.m. to 1 p.m., my nigga, I was moving like a fucking robot. Me, I probably wasn't showing it, but me mentally, I was going fucking crazy, nigga. There's clips of me just doing the dumbest shit and doing the dumbest shit because I don't know what else to do in that bitch. You only walk and talk in that bitch. 20 minutes cold showers, nigga. And if your fucking child or somebody that you know, watch that motherfucker. And pick up their phone and one day say, oh my God, jail looks fun. I want to go. You're doing a bad job at parents. You want to know why? One, why the nigga watching me? And two, why the fuck would he even think that shit? And three, your fucking kid is dumb as shit, nigga. The fuck? This I just recently found. I put the best prisons around the world for 2023. Now, this was just created November 8th, for, like I said, this month of 2023 from Yen.com. Originally, I had filmed this before on another one and it didn't film. Let, let me make sure it's filming. I basically was just talking and didn't record it. So 15 the best prisons in the world that you confuse for a home. Like I said, this was not promoted even in Kaisenet 7 Days Screaming a lot of stuff. Okay, updated. Like I said, it was updated on oh, also 10 55 p.m. by Jacqueline Warnery Ratio. Uh, uh, hopefully I did not mess up your name. The word prison contours of uh, the images of harsh living conditions, poor quality food, and restraining walls. 
while this is a norm or uh, correctional facilities, some of the best prisons in the world have gone as far as building prisons with modern amenities that allow inmates to maintain contact with the outside world. These prisoners also had the opportunity to engage in activities that promote personal growth while they serve their sentences. Okay. The inmates serving life sentences for serious offenses typically spend a significant proportion of their lives in jail. The best prisons in the world have transformed how offenders are afforded freedom in restricted areas, allowing them to communicate and maintain contact with the outside world. What are the best prisons of the world? Europe is home to the most luxurious best prisons in the world, which typically have a smaller uh, prison population, but a wide range of unique amenities. Like this is some hotel. Each facility has a sp special uh, characteristic that makes it luxurious. Here is a peek inside some of the best prisons in the world that you can confuse for a home. Okay, I seen this. Uh, most of them I searched and scanned through when I looked at there is the, the ones in Norway. This looks like a ranch house near a lake. Okay, Bastard Prison, Norway. Okay. Norway is home to some, some of the most luxurious prisons in the world, and Bastroy Prison is one of them. However, the facility only holds 100 inmates. It's a maximum security uh, facility that eliminates the possibility of mass brawls. Each inmate brass that gets to reside in a private, maladist-style cottage and participate in sports such as tennis, horseback riding, uh, cross-county skiing, and fishing. In fact, several former detainees claim that the facility is more vacational center than a jail. I think I pronounced that right. All right, next is Pandang Bandu Prison, Indonesia. Wait a minute, women prisons work for fashioning, okay. All right, uh, Pandu Bamboo is an all-female facility outfitted with everything from refrigerators to air conditioning to nail salons and karaoke machines. This complex filled with flowers and sculptures would be an undeniable haven for beauty treatments and recreational programs. Pandu Bamboo Prison is one of the best women prison worlds due to the presence of these luxurious amenities. Number three, HPM Adele, Scotland. Okay, Her Majesty Princess Adewell, located in South Southern Scotland, is one of the best rated prisons in the world. It is designated learning jail where each company is given 40, day, uh, uh, 40 hours each week to work consecutive skill development. The seven counties of Edwell are in excellent care. The facility probably focuses on preparing for successful uh, reiterations in society after release. Uh, Champ Darla Prison, Switzerland. Formerly known for overcrowding, uh, Champ Darla Prison is now its room, uh, roomy, triple occupation cells in a drawing bathroom. Inmates might imagine themselves less as inmates and more as roommates working together or recovery path because of the abundance of facilities available. Number five, Audrey Correction those in New Zealand. Okay, while the security measures are rigorous, our great curriculum offers against nice chambers a place of gay significance on skill development. This means it's transformation. Our group attempts efficiently to habitate by offering uh, uh, courses in dairy farm, art, light engineering, and cuisine. I drew prison in Spain. This correctional facility addresses how correctional facilities break fam uh, uh, break families by allowing children to spend their first years with reincarnated uh, parents with a player, cribs, Disney figures on the walls. Andrew Prison allows detained parents to experience peril despite their circumstances. No original prison Sweden. This financial facility provides individual cells with comfy mattresses and agent restrooms for its inmates. The inmates in uh, Swatter Prison enjoy first rate amenities such as fully equipped gym, a gym, the kitchen they're free to use, and comfortable leads room with television and couches. Norway is one of the Okay, Norway is one of the countries with the best prisons in the world. One of the well praised prisons, the headed prisons is deep. It's the best prison in the world because it provides its inmates with beautiful scenery surrounded by vast vegetation and natural light. Um, each combat receives private luxury living chambers. Hated prisons offers recreational area with movies, television shows, and video games, skill building classes, a fully equipped gym, and a fully operational recording uh, operational recording studio. Okay, J uh, uh, JVA Fusion Prison, Germany. JVA Fusion Prison Hansburg is among the best and most comfortable jails for long term inmates. In 2011, HVA uh, 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 F Prison w was free furbished and reopened. It includes roomy chambers for a bed, sofa, and unique combined solar shower toilet. In addition, inmates are provided with, with, a, with a small meeting room. 
Okay, Charlotte Castle, Switzerland. Okay, I guess this is it. Okay, the Charlie Castle in Switzerland near Negeva is one of the top 10 prisons in the world. It has served numerous purposes throughout history. The castle has operated as military force, enforcement station, medieval fort, and jail. It has also served as private property for summertime use. The facility is impressive in architecture and is steadily stunning, especially from a distance. And remember, carry your camera. This landmark is well worth the trip and even has more. HPM Burn Prison UK. The HPM Burn is among the, the, the best correctional facilities in the, in the United Kingdom. Emits in the cells have access to a laptop, phone, and shower. However, no devices are connected to Wi Fi. The provider laptops are used to order meals for the, the entire week plan business and weekly shopping and do uh, and do any academic weighted work this facility can house up to 2100 male detainees which are referred to as men rather than prisoners and guards knocking before they enter their chambers Several prison Philippines, although several prisons correction is not as luxurious as some of the jails on this list, it has been lead providing with opportunities to correct correct expressions and entertainment. Inmates for this retro scenic singing and dance of various musical collections, selections I meant to say. In addition to a forming for civilian audiences, these conferences are also signed autographs. Okay, that's inmates. Number 13, Justice Lieber, uh, Austria. Each justice uh, center email gets a single cell with a private bathroom, kitchenette, and television. In addition, the facility survives the inmates for the outdoor entertainment space, weight room, and basketball court. This is, I think, the only one. Okay, here's the California prison in the USA. The California prison is the most luxurious prisons in America. The facility decided to utilize this private unused jail that was constructed in 2000 and began charging an outrageous 159 for comments to stay in an unoccupied correctional facility. In addition to gaming, tablets, bathroom cells, uh, beds, and showers, inmates can access numerous entertainment programs on their wall screen HGTV. It shows significant improvement over the usual facility okay and the last one they're saying on this list the san pedro prison Baldobia. Baldobia. san Pedro may not be the most luxurious correctional facility but it does merit recognition for its unique approach to jail life san uh, pedro prison may be the most unconventionally comfortable correctional facility in the world with self-appointed leaves entire neighbors complete with home families cafes and businesses Okay, and that's it. Um, who has the best prison? In which this is just um large hotel toad. It just likes a general for information, so I'll just stop there. Which it said, who has the best prison? Well, they say Norway is. Okay, Norway. I'll just read this part and I'll finish. Norway prison system accommodates around 3,000 individuals and is widely recognized as one of the world's most efficient and com compassionate. Since the Norway capital punishment life of prisons are not a part of the legal framework. Okay, um, the best prisons will provide unique amenities, ensuring prisoners experience in a comfortable and safe life as they serve the sentences. These facilities are not meant for punishing owners, but rehabilitating and equipping them with the skills that would make uh that would make them better individuals after serving their jail terms and there's a recent published article on the largest trails of the world yeah okay i appreciate y'all who watched the state of this video i decided y'all i'm just gonna break up um that him were doing the stream with our little RT in my next um, video. I was gonna put it in here, but I'm like, this is already long enough. But what do y'all think about like his, you know, it was it a bad flume? Was it a bad look of him doing that? Personally, I don't think so, you know. And, you know, if we look at like, say, possible, I'm gonna show three possible examples. Hopefully, I ain't gotta edit them out or change them. You know, example like Sexy Red with this new video she's talking about free my baby daddy some shit. Um, you know, Mr. Beach, which is a very popular YouTuber, he recently did a milestone 200 mil million. What do you think about this type of miles? Like, do you think this is a bad influence or whatever? Doing some shit like this where he had himself buried alive for seven days. 
um in the last part which i'm glad they did take heed to was like you know um this health uh hayden heifer uh you know i you know i want to uh like agree with the man she you know did like some problematic stuff her what's her name pearly things pearl necklace um whatever her name is uh got demonetized and she used to be refreshing free freaking and funk whatever the fuck their name is you know that type of person uh you know women shouldn't vote she recently even put a tweet out talking about 16 girl, girls girls age 16 is hotter than women that are 26 and shit and um she also was like doing something claiming like you know as if slavery was uh put down for, uh you know uh was in Belgium, you know, it's not as bad as it seems, you know, them, them type, that type of shit. But tell me what y'all think, y'all, and thank you, y'all have hugs and love, and I definitely see y'all in the next video. And, um, like I said, enjoy y'all weekend until the next one. All right. Of course, I mentioned, of course, like hugs and loves, but like I said, hopefully, you know, what do y'all think about these type of clips, like, or, you know, um, that, like I said, I'm gonna show you again. Sorry, y'all, but. I need to go to bed. But anyway, y'all, take care. Just ran with his sight to break. And obviously, this goes without saying, but yes, this is 100% real. And I'll be honest, I severely underestimated how hard this was gonna be. And with that, the challenge has officially started. I am now trapped in here for the next seven days. It took the boys so long to bury me alive that I already have to pee, and the challenge just started. In case you're wondering how I used the bathroom down, what way was slavery made to seem more horrible than it was? Slavery and stuff, too. Because the big is they embellish. And I'm not trying to say it wasn't horrible, it was. Right. But they want to make it, like, more horrible. Um, we were talking about. I don't, I don't really want to go into this too much because we're kind of past this. But I was quoting a Thomas Sowell book. The, okay. Do you, so do you agree with that premise that slavery was embellished or no? Um, I think that there are parts that are un under embellished and there are parts that are over embellished. I think it just depends That's what we're so talking about. so interesting. I've got to know what was over embellished about slavery. <laughs> just like one example. I'm dying to know. Hmm. Yeah, I just, I just rather, I mean, I was talking about a book that I read. You just said some parts were embellished, some parts were under embellished. <laughs> I, I just think Are you retracting that? I just, I... I'd really just rather not. Okay. Do you know what slavery being embellished? That's so interesting. Um, um, I just, again, I was kind of hoping this was like a good faith interview. I just think you're trying to... That, that's a clip of you saying that. You can disavow it. I'm uh, quoting an author. You're not being honest. Like, okay, so you disavow it. Just disavow it then. That's easy. Just say, I don't think slavery was embellished. I mean, that's super easy. That's like a layup. <laughs> so well compared Barack Obama to Adolf Hitler. Do you like that analogy? <laughs> that's the author you're quoting. Hmm. Asking you, do you agree with that statement? Barack Obama <laughs> is comparable to Adolf Hitler. No? Okay. See, it's not hard. It's not hard. That's awesome. That's easy to do. You also said George Washington was viewed by, from his slaves like a father. Did you say that? Do you think racism was embellished? I mean, it's so easy. I mean, just say no. I, I can't say, hey, these slaves had a good relationship with their owners. Because it's not true. Because it's just not true. It's not true. What George Washington was not a father figure to his slaves. Okay. Fair. To be totally fair, you could just say, I don't think slavery was embellished. Like, you, you I mean, you, you were but just that's super easy. It like that's a layup for most people. I was quoting a book. That's the crazy part. I was quoting a book. So, so do you agree like, with this statement, though? Um, do I think overall it was embellished? Some parts, sure. There it is. Which part? Some parts. No, please tell me which part. I think, tell me. I think that you can't... I think that certain slaves had good relationships with their owners. Not all. Maybe not most, but I think some did. And that's just... Uh, and and there, are accounts of, there are accounts of them saying this. So, some slaves had good relationships with their masters. Therefore, slavery yeah, was embellished? Know, but you need to just say, I don't think it was embellished? I, okay, I really appreciate you having me on, um, but I'm, I'm gonna go. Thank you. George, Thank you. Okay, I, I appreciate you. Okay.